So a breathless afternoon, but three much deserved points to mm. for Crawley. Yeah, I, I was very proud um, of our team today. I thought it was a, a very difficult game um, against a team that uh, are very much in you, at you, very pressed, very high, very aggressive in, in how they press you, trying to disrupt your rhythm. And, and they did, to be fair, got the goal. Then we gave a poor goal away with a clear and sloppy goal. Um, then we got. I think we've done. I said at half time that you have you will come up against mentalities where you have to be strong and believe in the values of what we do. And what we do is we want to try and play our way, and we can't switch that. You know, we've got to stick to our, our principles. Uh, but I did ask them to clear the ball better. You know, I don't ask them for like bring it down on the chest and take the mickey. I want us to be uh, resolute in how we defend. But I thought that some of the play second half because they they can't run forever teams. You know, and um, credit to our team. You know, it's a difficult game. I think Lady Luck. I think Glenn might have tipped that. I think uh, Graham was saw that on the line. And sometimes things go our way. Um, but I fully think you just a lot of managers say your luck evens out over the season. Um, I'm just really pleased because they're buzzing in there, the boys. They're, they're going on a team bond into Dublin and good luck to them. Um, I think Matt's going to surprise them tomorrow and come. Um, chaperone. Chaperone, yeah, right. They'll be chaperoning him. Um, and we're doing the staff party tonight for all our staff to have a, 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 a Christmas drink. And it's a really lovely feeling. There's no better feeling than winning and knowing that we go now into awe and having accumulated points after a poor run and where we, we stood firm as a team which was very important so I'm very happy I'm very happy for the staff I thought the fans were fantastic they're with us you know and it, it's a great energy you know and the team take over uh, for me as a coach it's so important that it's not what I'm yelling on the line because I don't overly yell I do the fourth official a bit but they monitor the game and I think that that's credit to everybody's work you know that we get players th uh, thought provoking they can think for themselves they demand of themselves and that's the one of the elements I think of a good team special moment three goals different goal scorers today but special moment for Jimmy Smith because mm. his grandfather Absolutely. died during the week and that goal was dedicated to him wasn't yeah it? yeah it's uh, it's it's emotional and and it's life we, we you know Jimmy's a very he, he runs his heart out for the club um, I actually think it's it was meant to be he scored that goal um, he's, he's a lovely lad, Jimmy. The boys have been fantastic. Um, we visited Chestnut Tree House yesterday to see the difficult circumstances of other people's lives. And it brings it home, but it is nice. I was really pleased for him that he can give that message to his granddad who's watching up in heaven. Three wins out of four. We talked earlier in the week about momentum. We've got a bit now. We're going into a couple of tough away fixtures over Christmas. Yeah, but the, I think teams that look at us when we go, we've got a tougher fixture. I, I don't, you know, I respect every team, but I'm very big on what we are. We're Crawley Town, and how we, you know, uh, present ourselves. It's very important that I work on the opposition with Matt, but we actually push what we're about because the players want to play football. You know, I'm getting, you've got players playing delightful football out there, but also working hard. So it's more about us and we're coming to you, you know, and you've got to look at what we can do against you. you know, and I, I just really am uh, looking forward to having a beer tonight with the staff because they deserve it. Kelly and all their office, yourselves have been really very, we've all stuck together. Um, we know Matt drives us mad in the office with you lot, but, you know, we, we'll have a little break now because we want to go again for the second half of the year. And a Happy New Year to all the fans. Have a peaceful and prosperous one.